Hey everyone, Sarah here, the Fruitarian Dancer. Um, it's coming into summer, not quite summer yet, but I thought I'd do another What I Eat in a Day video because um, I do change from season to season what I eat. I eat seasonally. Um, so the summer foods are in season. And this is my breakfast. Four kilos, which is about nine pounds, of watermelon. So I've been out for just an easy jog this morning, a jog slash walk. Um, my body felt tired, so I listened to that, didn't push it. Done a bit of stuff around the house. It's 20 to 9, and I'm going to get stuck into my watermelon. And I'll be back with you at lunchtime. See you then. Hey, I'm back. It's 2.30, and I've been really active all day. It was my morning off, so I've been sweeping my garage and gurning and just on my feet all day. And this watermelon that I cleaned out for breakfast, four kilos, that really filled me up. It's really satisfying. I think that's about a thousand calories I've got to check. Um, basically, I think it's more important to eat until you're 100% full, 100% satisfied rather than counting calories. Um, and I just scooped it out with a spoon, so it's good because this is full of juice. So I'm going to make an entree for my lunch. I was so full I couldn't drink the watermelon juice afterwards. So I'm just tipping this in to a strainer, fine strainer, and sort of pips in there. And yeah, making some beautiful watermelon juice for my lunch entree. Alrighty, so here's the finished product. A juice of half a watermelon. So that watermelon kept me going for over five hours. The, and it cost me $2.70. $2 my calculations are cor correct. So, yeah, 1,000 calories for $2.70, so that's a good value meal. Okay, so the rest of my lunch is going to be mangoes. I just bought these today, uh, $27 a tray. So this is obviously my staple at this time of year, $108 worth of mangoes sitting there. So again, I'm just going to eat until I'm 100% full. So I have to come back and let you know how many I got through. Um, a mango, according to Chronometer, is about 200 calories. Um, these ones, I think, are a little bit less. Um, yeah, so I'll be back soon. Okay, so I'm back again. It's actually a couple of nights later. Um, so I ended up eating six mangoes, and then I went and out and taught a couple of yoga classes, and then I got home and had to get ready to go out again and went out and actually skipped dinner. So um, I went to see my new boyfriend and by the time I got to his house it was pretty late and just too late to eat dinner and I skipped it, which I don't recommend but I'm being truthful. Um, I did have trouble sleeping that night and I think that's why. Um, but yeah, I just wasn't hungry when I got there. Um, I did check the watermelon I ate was actually 1,200 calories. So that's why that kept me going for so long. And then the six mangoes, that could be up to 1,200 calories as well. So I did have over 2,000 calories, less than what I usually eat. I had a huge calorie day the day before. So um, as I said, I always just listen to my body. Some days I need more calories than others. Um, I do usually have a big salad at the end of the day. I have every other night of the week. So my salad has uh, lettuce, baby spinach, celery, tomato, and I cut up mango and put that through it as well. The mango juice makes a really nice dressing. But I will do another video on salad um, and show your salad dressing as well another time. But basically all I had um, that day was the two meals, the watermelon and then six mangoes. So um, that's it.